hyacinth plants have been removed from the dam since April. The alien water plants have covered large parts of the surface of the water, making water activities like boating and fishing virtually impossible. Hyacinth, an alien plant from South America. It has invaded several dams and rivers in South Africa, including Hartpiespoor Dam. Last year, the Hartpiespoor Dam Integrated Biological Remediation Program, called Metsi Ame, was cancelled. As a result, the growth of the plant spiralled out of control, covering 60% of the 2,300 hectare dam. It is detrimental to its fish population and biodiversity, and local tourism also suffered a severe blow. The dam was created as an irrigation dam in the 1920s to, for the farmers downstream. But in the, since the 1980s, it's, it's just become a tourist area and a place where people want to stay. There's a lot of estate developments around the dam and the people want to get access to the water to use the water. Either it be for water skiing, for boating, for fishing, for jet skiing, canoeing, or just to sit on the side of the shores and picnic and just enjoy the ambience of what the Mahalis has got to offer as well as the dam, the tranquility. Of the there was local concern about the increased growth of the hyacinth plants. Residents and businesses pulled their resources together to address the problem. They established the Harpiespoor Dam Rehabilitation Steering Committee early this year. Permits were granted by the Department of Water Affairs for the removal of the hyacinths. The aim is to eventually establish here a sustainable hyacinth population which will be roughly between 5 and 10 percent of the surface area of the dam in other words 100 to 200 hectares but under controlled conditions so that we can capture them and harvest them to sustain a business where we will convert the hyacinth that we have harvested into valuable products. The hyacinth growth has been contained to about 18% of the dam's surface coverage. Plans are also underway to turn the dry plants into fire briquettes. Nicoline Smallman, SABC News, Hartpiespoor Dam.